my name is David Welch. I'm the owner-operator of Welch & Rush Incorporated. We're a mechanical contracting company located in Upper Marlboro, Maryland. Welch & Rush was founded in 1966. Uh, my father and James Rush founded the company. So we just had our 50th anniversary last summer and we've been going strong. James and Pete started the company as a plumbing services company. They were originally Welch & Rush Plumbing Services. So all they did was plumbing and somewhere in the late 1970s they decided to get onto the HVAC side and they hired the first steam fitter, a gentleman named Bob Butlin. They started a HVAC service department and that really allowed for quite a bit of growth. There's more work on the HVAC side than the plumbing side in Washington, D.C. So once they acquired an HVAC division, things really started to take off. In 2000, Jimmy Rush retired and uh, Pete Welch bought him out. They were about a $15 million a year company. Um, I had worked off and on in the trade um, up until that time. And in 2000, I got a phone call from Pete asking me to come back to Welch and Rush. I was working for a competitor at the time. So from 2000 to 2008, we went from 15 million to 80 million and we did it mainly based on our reputation. Of course, those were some incredible times. The construction industry in Washington, D.C. was just booming. So we took advantage of that and experienced quite a bit of growth. And we used that strength in all of our lessons from 2008 to now to sustain us, keep us strong, and uh, we've kept a, a really decent market share in Washington, D.C. I decided to run the, the, that, that I would like to be the owner of Welch & Rush uh, probably uh, somewhere in the late 1980s. I actually wanted to be a farmer, and I was gonna go to college to become a farmer. Um, agriculture was my first love, and I realized sometime, maybe three or four semesters in to college, that business was more my interest. Um, so I switched my major to uh, business administration, ended up going through Steamfitters Local 602, uh, did a five-year apprenticeship, and started working at Welch & Rush, left Welch & Rush as a first-year apprentice, did it purposely. Uh, my father and I decided that it was best to work for different companies, to learn different corporate cultures, see the way different companies run. So I probably worked for maybe four or five different companies throughout my career. And then uh, in 2000, I came back and started working this last stretch for Welch and & Rush. And in 2006, I took Welch & Rush over. Uh, my father decided it was time to retire, so I took the company over. And in 2011, I uh, bought the company from him. The reason I had made a change when I was in college um, from business administration to getting into steam fitting, I, I was at University of Maryland, I was three semesters in, and my father came to me one day and said, I don't know why you're in college, you should be a steam fitter, you should go through the trade, you can eventually take over my company. So I was three semesters into college, left college, which was a mistake, went through a five-year apprenticeship program, then ended up getting married, and then I decided to go back and finish my business administration degree. So it worked out well, because now I've got five-year apprenticeship, so I'm a journeyman with uh, Steam Fitters Local 682. I also have my uh, business administration degree. So it's, it's the best of both worlds.